Hello guys, welcome. My name is Nenta Azalesi and I'm your instructor in this video editing course. Okay, so the app we are going to be using is called CapCut and um, in today's in this video which is um, our first video, we are going to look at the introduction to the app before we start um, doing project on it. Okay, so this is the app I believe you have already. So I'm going to open my app so this is my app now so i'm just going to tap on it and it will open up okay all right so this is my app you can see these are the project i've done already these are the project i've worked on everything appearing here these are project i've worked on the um, this is this is how the interface looks like this is a new project this is auto cut. I will talk about this when we start um, design, when we start editing our videos. Okay, then up here we can we have um, <coughs> the um, from the uh, YouTube tutorial, ask question and all that. Then here you can sign in with your email account. Then here we have the, our settings. Okay, all right. So that's that. This is how the interface looks like. So first thing first, what you will do is to tap on the tap on the new project that's when you want to create a new project you're just going to tap on that so here they will ask you to select a clip or if you okay so when you get here they will ask you to select a clip that you want to use so either these are all the clips in my phone gallery so here let's start from the top to the bottom so here we have up albums that's where um, you can tap on there to choose where you are um, let's say maybe you want to pick a video from uh, your whatsapp video or any folder like that that's where you check then here yeah, these are the pre these are um, these are stock videos provided for you by CapCut. well tap on that you will see then these are your own videos in your phone gallery then these are the photos in your phone gallery okay all right so let's move on now so now tap well, if you want to pick any video, any video in your phone, you just tap on here. These are the videos you can select from. But if you want to change, if you want to select a location in your phone, just tap on the albums. So when you tap on the albums, you can see different um, folder here. You can pick any folder. Yeah, you can let's say my videos are inside my download folder. So if I just tap on my download folder, the album that was appearing up there will change to download okay so we also have um, stock videos from um, if you tap on the stock videos this is what you will have make sure your uh, mobile data is is on as you are doing this okay so here you can see uh, most uh, most used um, short videos or uh, in video editing they are here so you can see the end you can see some of this stuff we'll talk about them later on when we start working on um, on project okay this is just an intro to the app so here you can see photos if you tap on photos here you will see the um, photos in your phone okay in your download folder because it is a um, download that is download folder that we selected up there that is why you are seeing um, all the photos in my download folder here okay all right so let's just pick a clip from here and let's move on so i'm just going to pick this clip so let's pick this all right so this is it so this is the main area where you can start doing your editing job so here we are just going to take it step by step so we are going from the top to the bottom now so all right so let's move on so here let's talk about this first let's talk about everything here yeah? let's talk about everything happening here okay so here we have section by section this is section one then this is another section sorry all right so this is another section then we also have another section here and we also have um, another section here okay all right so let's move on from the top from let's call this number one so let's call this one let's call this two let's call this three and let's call this four so we are starting from one now all right so let's move on so at the top here we have uh, here we have the exit icon here we have the 
can use this to choose uh, the resolution you want to save your work on in here we have uh, the, uh, the export icon so if i should tap on the uh, resolution icon you can see you can choose the resolution of uh, 480p 720p 180p frame rate and all that okay we'll talk about that more later all right so if i want to export this video this is what i do i will tap on the export icon appearing up here so because i don't want to export it now i won't tap on that but i just want to show you the use of that okay all right so here is your, your preview area so everything you're working on you can preview it here okay this is your preview area so you can see if i move like this if i move like this you can see anything happening down here is previewing up here okay so that is the use of this this is called the preview area okay all right so let's move on don't bother about this thing showing on my screen it's just an illustration i'm using okay it's not part of the app all right okay so let's go here so here we have uh, some um, some numbers shown here the first number which is um, zero is um, uh, three seconds this indicates where this uh, playhead is okay all right so we'll talk about that later then this also is uh, this uh, eight seconds is the total length of our uh, entire video that is everything done here that is the um, zero seconds okay so let's move on then we also have um, the play button here we have the undo and we have the redo then we have the full screen um, um, preview icon there okay All right when we start working on it you will get to know those things better then here we have our timeline here so this is where we bring in all our layers when we are editing our video this is called timeline then these smaller numbers you are seeing there those are the uh, those represent um, if you expand let's say if you want to expand your video so that you, you can be exact while working on your work you just use your two finger at the dark area here use your two finger pan it like this just the way I the icon goes just use your two finger and you can pan it around so it will make it bigger for you to um, it will make this number smaller so you can do exact um, um, edit on your video okay so i'm just going to make that small all right so here we have the cover you can choose cover for your video when you upload before uploading this is a um, cover so if you tap on that you can choose cover for your video so that uh, when you export your video as full video i want to upload it on facebook or any platform you want to upload it on that this cover will be the first it will be let's say a thumbnail that people will see all right then here we have uh, if you want to mute your audio from if you want to mute audio on your um, on your video clips you can tap on that to mute that audio okay all right so let's move down to the last part here okay sorry we are not done with the uh, number three we are not done with that so let's go on so here this is a, a, a video clip which you have added then the plus button here we use this to add another clip to our video okay then here we use this icon to add audio okay so this is another important thing you will need to know about this vertical bar that you see here this indicates um this indicates the exact position um, of our video so here you can see this bar is at um, it's as um, two seconds you can see indicating he, it there so if i move this if i move use my hand to move my video forward you can see the bar changes to the bar goes to another position and the time here changes to five seconds if i move it back the time changes to three seconds okay that's the essence of that bar okay all right so let's move on now to the downside so the down area area here we have an uh, edit we have edit, we have audio, we have text, stickers, overlay, effect. Okay, these are the things you can add to your timeline. This is the timeline. Those are the things we can add to our timeline. If you use your finger to move this way, if you move this way, you can see other options here. We have uh, filters, format, canvas, and adjust. Okay, those are that's just the introductory part of 
this app so now you know where each of these things are and um, in the next video we'll talk about how to import clips and to make the little changes on our clip all right guys i will see you in that next video